here we are in our theater room and here's the columns that my very handy husband is building he installed the boxes that he pieced together onto the wall and now he's installing the molding pieces and here's the chair rail here it takes a little dip here because there's a step down there <clears throat> yeah so here's our projector and we've got surround sound speakers here 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 and here and we've got a lot of work to do in here i plan on painting the ceiling black and probably putting some type of decorative molding on the ceiling as well so it gives it more of a grand theater room feel it's a small space but i, I think we could still give it a nice feel he's going to also build a little small moon shape stage in front of the screen and that'll happen eventually but he's got so much work to do in here i don't think it's going to happen really soon but he has more columns to place over there where the blue tape is and a column here as well one of the kids probably pulled off the the mark of the blue tape but i'm sure he'll measure again and figure out exactly where he's going to place the next column i did a lot of the painting in here actually most of it and as you can see i used the metallic gold paint on the strip and the molding up there i just thought it'd be a nice touch and it does look nice i was explaining earlier that the profile for the column and the back are not exactly the same size as the profile here and the reason why is because we didn't want to interfere with the recline to the seats here so what we wound up doing was making the profile i don't remember what, the, what my husband said what the profile to these columns are i think these are maybe four and a half inches or something like that and the ones in the back are probably maybe two and a half inches protruding out from the wall he's also going to put some molding pieces like um what do you mean throw like here? right right so the, the where jamal's pointing we're going to do some like squares we're going to do some squares with oh, some like the inside the inside with a fabric panel in there probably something that goes nicely with the color of the curtains that are surrounding our screen so far the job's coming along very nicely i guess i'll try and keep you guys along with the progress these are just temporary seats very inexpensive but we just did something because we do actually watch movies in here even though the room's not completed we have the sound system the projector the screen all that is completely hooked up so we can actually enjoy movies in here eventually we'll wind up changing these seats out to something a lot nicer and also we will change out the carpet um this carpet was actually construction grade carpet i suppose that the builders put in when we were having the home built so we're gonna wind up taking that out as well and um replacing the carpet there he is taking measurements and getting ready to go outside and cut some more molding trim pieces it a little bit more okay awesome job you working on chair row mm-hmm how's it look looks great looks good Okay, let's see what progress my darling husband has made. Wow, look at that. So he's almost done with the crown on the back wall. As you can see, it's supposed to go all the way around. May I have the level? Zero. I'm helping. So Sam will install an outlet over here so that we will have some place to plug in the rope light that will go behind the crown. So right now it's white and of course we'll have to paint it so that it matches everything else. Yeah, I see you have some spots here on the wall that you must have 
it. I see a few spots, so I'll have to touch paint the room once he's completely done. And this is the rope lighting that sits behind the crown so when we turn the lights off it has a nice soft glow in the room it doesn't give off too much light because of course you don't want too much light so you don't want it to be too dark where you're going to trip on something and I hope you enjoyed our design ideas. Comment below, give this video a thumbs up, and don't forget to subscribe. Till next time.